The Honourable Member for Brandon East. Well, thank you very much and good afternoon, Madam Speaker. Uh, we all cheer on the, uh, the Winnipeg Jets, the Winnipeg Blue Bombers. Heck, we have the Manitoba Moose and the Winnipeg Gold Eye, and of course my favourite, the Brandon Weekings. Now imagine for a moment a uh, tiny little nation of Iceland battling its way to place in the world's second largest sporting event, the World Cup of Soccer. Today is a special day as I stand here before my colleagues and congratulations, congratulate achievements so well done that they will be talked about forever. Now, Madam Speaker, I'm very proud of my Icelandic heritage, as you can tell, and, but many of you may be asking, why am I standing in Manitoba talking about amazing results from a team from Iceland, from an isolated volcanic island in the North Atlantic, where they have secured one of only 32 spots for the summer Games or the Summer World Cup in Russia. Well, Madam Speaker, not only do I share a heritage with these great folks, you see, there's a little bit more that I share. The core of Iceland's squad has been together for more than a decade, Madam Speaker, but they've been there longer in my family tree. I'm very proud to say that 19 of these young athletes are my relatives. Madam Speaker, many people say that a Cinderella story in 2016 is when the Icelandic national football team qualified. Well, I dare say they were just warming up. So this is a great time for Icelanders everywhere, Madam Speaker, and I ask all of my colleagues to please join me in welcoming Thedur Bjorn Gjornsson, the Council General for Iceland, who is here to celebrate this achievement with us all. Yeah. 